The blues music emanating from the Beach Street Bistro in Crossit is only rivaled by the aroma coming from the kitchen. That is crawfish and chicken and Koneka sausage and heavy cream and Velveeta and thick sliced mushrooms. Chester Huntsman can belt out the ingredients to his crawfish pie the way he can belt out a blues song. She left a lipstick message on me. We tried to look like a Mississippi juke joint, but we have the heart of a Cracker Barrel. I'll be next Tuesday before the milk gets all out that kid. Huntsman, the brother of the late Johnny Huntsman, founder of Johnny's Pizza, has taught his staff to cook the way he likes to cook. From rich and creamy mac and cheese to hand battered, with a little help from this contraption, onion rings. There's also hot water cornbread and melt in your mouth buttery yeast rolls. Pam Riley says she loves everything on the menu, but is especially crazy about the crawfish pie. It's so rich, and it's it's just full of everything: chicken, sausage, crawfish, and the flavor is just out of this world. Now Chester loaded me up with what he calls his signature dishes. I'm gonna try this pork chop sandwich. <laughs> no D in there, right? Just just no, sandwich. Mmm. Wow. I knew somebody with the name Chester was going to be able to make the best fried pork chop sandwich I have ever had. <laughs> when I leave here, I'm going to be the size of a small school bus, and I don't even care. <laughs> I know it tastes good together. You know, it's just that's a gift, I think, because this is all I can do is cook and put on show. Night just wouldn't go Listening or eating, you can drink in the ambiance of the creative decor. Is it a blues bar, minus the alcohol, or is it a Creole cottage? The girls, Denise Morris and Sheila Dickerson did all. Between the artist's renderings and Huntsman's handiwork, this old house percolates with personality. And if you feel a little something different when you walk into this place, it could be the prep work before the doors even open. Or should I say, prayer work. Pray in Jesus' name, amen. For God to give us the opportunity to come in, and for all the people that come in, they leave here thinking, that was great. We got to be a blessing to people, and that's absolutely what it's all about, you know? In Crossit, I'm Tammy Orander for KNOE 8 News.